Yo, what is up, Loud and Proud crowd? Hopefully you guys are doing absolutely fantastic. We are about to call our winner, David, who won the giveaway for the truck. And I have not talked to him yet. My attorney emailed me yesterday and said, this is the guy who won, this is the truck he wants. You are now welcome to call him at any time you'd like. So we're gonna give him a call. Anyway, so now let's give our friend David here a call and uh, get his reaction. Now keep in mind, he did already talk to my attorney. He's already submitted paperwork. So he's already known that he's been the winner for like over 24 hours now. So um, it's one of those deals where his reaction might be a little bit different now that he's already had a little bit of time to let it sink in. Of course, it's gonna be different when he's here in person and he actually sees the truck or when the truck is in person with him. Uh, but you guys just have to keep that in mind that, you know, winning a vehicle like this isn't just something that anybody can relate to. It doesn't really happen to anybody, um, hardly ever. So it's, it's kind of like a reaction that can't really be replicated or you can't have a certain expectation to. It's just one of those deals, but we're gonna give him a call, see which truck he picked, why he picked that truck, and then uh, hear a little bit about him. Sitting in my mom car here. So we're gonna give our friend David here a call. Hello, is this David? Yep, this is David. How you doing? What's up, man? This is Loud and Proud Malachi, man. I'm just calling to uh, say congratulations on your win of the truck giveaway. Yeah, thank you. Just to chat with you for a little bit, if that's all right. Do you have time? Yeah, I got time. Awesome. So, my first question is, uh, where are you from, man? I'm from uh, Bunker Hill, Indiana. It's right south of Peru. How long have you been uh, watching the videos and stuff? Uh, you have the white 12 valve when I started watching. So, about a year then. Probably yeah. about a year. That's cool. So I gotta ask you, man. Which truck did you which truck did you select when the guy gave you a call? Uh, the uh, ninety one twelve valve. Oh man, that's a that's a sweet truck. That thing is cherry, <laughs> literally cherry. It's right. Yeah. When when the guy called, he uh, he asked me, and I I told him he goes, I've never heard of anyone selecting the uh, lesser valued one, and I said, well, my dad had one. Yeah. that style when I was growing up, so I've kind of got a little sentimental attachment. Yeah, for sure. And that truck, is, I mean, yeah, it's in just awesome, awesome shape. And, and I was telling people, and I'm like, the fourth gen, don't get me wrong, it's an awesome truck, but I can go buy a fourth yeah. gen on, on any lot right now. You know what I mean? That, yeah. that first gen, I mean, you can find them, but it's not like, they're not just every corner, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, exactly, and trying to find them that aren't all, all rusted out and tore yeah. up is not impossible anymore. Yeah, it's a pain in the butt. I mean, I was I was lucky I found that one. I jumped as soon as I found that. I scraped it up. Yeah. But um, real quick question. That truck, I'm going to actually take it to our local shop right around the corner that we have all of our stuff done at. They work on all of our, our big diesel. I'm just going to have them look the truck over, just make sure everything's perfect. Everything should be good. The front end was all redone, the brakes and everything. I'm just going to have them look it over again, make sure alignment's perfect, and there's absolutely no, no issues um, that you could ever run into. And then also... I was going to ask you if you wanted me to do a couple small things for you on the truck that I wanted to get done. I just didn't ever do it because the truck was just sitting there. But if you would like, I could have the windows tinted at my cost. And then I could also, if you wanted, and then I could also have a um, uh, shop around here put a sound system in the truck because it doesn't have a radio in the dash. Well, actually, to be completely honest, I got a buddy of mine that does window tinting, and he does it for free for me, so I just have him do it. And okay. The radio, I'm not really worried about, so. Okay. Yeah, I just didn't know, because there's, there's just a hole in the dash there where the radio was. Would you be able to include the stock rooms with it, or? Oh, yeah, you can have them. Yeah, they're yours if you want them. All right. Yeah. All right, cool. Are you wanting to come up and get the truck, or are you wanting us to deliver it to you? Either is fine. Uh... I can I can come up. My dad and I actually had already talked about that. He okay. said he'd bring me up there to get it. Sounds good. At least it's not that bad of a drive. The last giveaway winner had to drive seven hours both ways. That yeah, that wasn't fun. So he couldn't he couldn't hang out more than 15, 20 minutes because he had a jet and go home. I kind of laughed when I got the call from the uh, all the giveaway people because I've never won anything in my life. I figured to my luck, but get a 
lottery ticket i'd have to pay on it <laughs> yeah yeah i mean so so what was your initial reaction because of course you know i don't i don't get to make the first phone call so i don't know like i really never have gotten to hear anybody's initial reaction on on these giveaways you kind of like in shock not know what to say thought it was a joke well, i told the guy when he told me that so this is a joke right and he goes no and i said Okay. <laughs> like right now I got a I have a O four Dodge that I drive. It's a good truck but it needs some body work. But yeah, when I saw that first and I kinda of fell in love with it since it got it on there, so Yeah. I mean I like all my trucks but I out of any first and we've had, that's the cleanest of them all. Even my dad's white one with eighty thousand miles on it. Even that has yeah. you know, fender rust and door rust and rocker rust starting, and I mean it's just not as clean. Yeah. Clean, not as clean. Well, I was gonna say the plus side is too now you can delete your uh, your mega cap. I know that that truck's gonna get some work now too. I'm actually gonna make some phone calls today and uh, get that truck scheduled for deletes, lift, wheels and tires on it, stance it out. I mean it's gonna be. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be awesome. And then also, I'm trying to get a hold of a guy today to go and pick up an OBS F-350 of four-door long beds. I had an OBS 7.3 for my first truck, at red and white. So like when I come up, I can show you the pictures of it. But awesome. It is a good truck. Pretty darn excited when I got that call, so. Oh yeah. Yeah, uh, and, and everybody, you know, you'll see in the comments, oh, he's not as excited as I would have been. I would have been screaming my head. I'm like, nobody can relate. You know what I mean? It's not like, most people don't even know anybody who's won anything so it's not like you can have a certain one type of reaction you're supposed to have it's just kind of like until it's you you don't you don't understand you know what i mean it's just one of those deals yeah i mean i'm not gonna lie i was pretty darn excited i ended up calling my dad right away and i told him and i had to pull my phone away from my ear because i think he was as excited as i was all righty thank you sir thank you i'll keep in touch on text all right, have a good one. You too, man, thanks, bye. So there is our giveaway winner. There was some audio in there that was kind of like winded out, so I don't know if you could hear it well or if I was able to keep certain clips because of that audio, but um, nonetheless, the guy's stoked. He's like, I was on the phone with my dad and he was freaking out and excited, I was excited, and I, I think he was more excited than I was, and I'm at first, I'm like, this is a joke, you know what I mean, like, nobody wins stuff, you know what I mean, and he's like, I got a truck you know what I mean like the dude's getting a truck man like he's getting a sweet truck and like I said like there's gonna be some people that are kind of like why did he want the first gen you know what I mean like it's a, there's a the latest and greatest the Longhorn the Mega Cab but you know he wants a first gen he you know like he like you said he like he's already got a good daily driver in 04 Dodge you know he doesn't need another you know nice up-to-date daily driver he's like so he just wanted, you know, set for sentimental value and purpose, he wanted the first gen. And that's completely cool, you know what I mean? So so I also want to say thank you to you, David, for selecting that truck because now I get to hang on to my Longhorn, my baby, just a little bit longer and then get some stuff done to it. I want to do, you guys already heard some stuff, I want to do lift, wheels, tires, um, deletes and tunes and all that stuff and just make it an absolute awesome, awesome monster of a truck and just make it really cool. Everybody who entered that giveaway, I just want to say thank you, thank you thank you so much everybody is very very highly valued and appreciated and look at the bright side now we get to see longhorn content we get to see obs content and then also we still have that first gen content coming to you guys um, and then in between of course we have some exciting stuff like this coming up but just a lot of busy stuff a lot of stuff's going down this next month or two it's going to be packed i'm going to make a bunch of phone calls today and get the uh you know stuff lined up for the OBS that I'm picking up get stuff lined up for the Longhorn to get deletes and tunes and stuff like that and lifts and um, I mean it's just gonna be awesome 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 so thank you guys so much for all the love and support you guys are absolutely incredible making dreams come true one day at a time not just mine but for you know a lot of people out there and it's just awesome it is just really really cool just keep in mind also I don't do these drawings I basically submit everything and it all is done legally through attorneys and agencies that deal with this kind of stuff um, and they draw a random person with all the names entered and then that's that's how it is thank you guys so much you guys are awesome love you guys um, i will catch you in the next video obs may be coming in the next video so stay tuned peace